Hi, I'm Catherine and I'm an embroidery expert. In this video, I'm going to show you how to create a layered scene embroidery piece. Let's get started. If you like this video, don't forget to subscribe to Hobbycraft and click the bell icon to be notified of future videos. You will need threads, scissors, needles, erasable pen, embroidery hoop, scrap fabric, and a free pattern available on the Hobbycraft Ideas Hub. This project is a great way to take your embroidery skills to the next level. Using plain fabric scraps and matching embroidery thread colours to make a stunning piece for your home. Visit the Ideas Hub to find the free downloadable templates. Use three strands of embroidery thread throughout this design. Download the free templates and gather your materials. You'll want to cut a square of the background colour that is approximately 3cm larger than your 6 inch embroidery hoop. Use the templates to trace the fabric shapes with a heat erasable pen, then cut. Once all the pieces are cut, trace the rest of the design that is going to be embroidered onto the fabric. Put all of the pieces of fabric together, place into the 6 inch hoop and pin where needed. stitch around the sun, making sure there's minimal gaps between each stitch. around each of the clouds using a simple whip stitch and making sure there is an even gap between each stitch. For the white part of the wave, satin stitch along the edge. The stitches will meet in the middle at the narrowest part. Remove the piece from the hoop and take a smaller 4 inch hoop and place around the green grass section. Whip stitch along the top edge. Take the thread and weave it over and under the stitches twice. Place the 6 inch hoop around the piece. Whip stitch the top of the C. Chain stitch the 3 seagulls.
stem stitch the stems of the pampas grass. Fishbone stitch the fluffy parts of the pampas grass. For the shells, follow all the lines with a back stitch. Once you have finished stitching, press well with an iron to remove the pen marks. Tighten the hoop as much as you can. Trim the excess fabric around the hoop so that you're left with approximately 1.5cm of fabric. Use three strands of thread to add a running or gathering style stitch to the back. Stitch the whole way round and pull tight. Knot the ends together and cut the excess thread. Your piece is now finished and ready to be displayed. Go to hobbycraft.co.uk to book a workshop, find your next craft project or learn a new skill. If you enjoyed this video, please leave a like and we'd love to see your thoughts in the comments below. See you soon for more videos.